Hello, this is R-I-C-K-Y, the Android guy. Hey guys, today I'm going to be showing you how to speed up the Huawei GX8. Now, this is a simple process, but one that you definitely want to do so you can make your phone faster. First thing you're going to do is go to all the way at the bottom of the settings box, and under all, go to about phone at the bottom right here. And then you're going to look for build number, which is right here. And you're going to hit that repeatedly. And it takes about seven times. Once you have that, you are now a developer. Congratulations. Then you have developer options. Right here, you just tap this. And you don't do anything here unless I tell you to, because you can damage your phone in this section. So always be careful. From here, you're going to swipe up and go to the drawing category. Under the drawing category, you're gonna see three things that say 1X. You're going to tap each of them and change them to 0 0.5. What this does is it actually tells your phone, hey, I know you take a second to do everything, but you can actually do it in half. And now you're gonna see your button presses will go a lot quicker than they did before. Everything just moves uh, smoother and quicker all around so really great to learn when it comes to that the next thing you're going to want to do is get rid of any of the built-in bloatware you do not need so you have some from google here uh, for instance play newsstand i never use so i can just grab that drag it up to the top and go right there and now it's uninstalled just that simple and easy to remove any of the built-in stuff now if it's a built-in program say such as files you cannot get rid of it as it tells you right there it's a system application you cannot get rid of it but if it's anything else like a Huawei support app well I don't need that so let's just get rid of that let's get rid of up let's get rid of Amazon music and let's get rid of Kindle and so there you have it. So this is a great, simple, and easy way to get rid of apps so that they don't take up RAM, cache, or battery life. Now, two important ones that you do not want to take out, even if you can, is the voice search and the Google app. Why? Because if you get rid of those, you will indeed actually get rid of voice to text so you can no longer voice to text and your mic will disappear on all your keyboards. All right, guys, hopefully you did like this video. If you did, please give a like, thumbs up down below. This has been R-I-C-K-Y, the Android guy.